percent chance of rain. All right, let's get into the tropics. There is nothing out there, nothing threatening us at the moment. And actually, if you look closely at what is highlighted by the National Hurricane Center, there's barely anything even visible to point out at this point. But models are picking up on some development as this low pressure, very kind of loose low pressure area starts to move somewhere near the northern Caribbean or Bahamas by Thursday, and then maybe wraps up to the north around some high pressure, which I'll show you in a second. So this is a very early look. Definitely don't want to just uh, hang too much on what these models are saying. I'm showing you a full week plus out because I know you're probably just interested, but keep in mind this is really too early to say for sure. But again, this is a different model showing a similar kind of setup, little bit more organization, maybe as we get toward uh, Thursday. I've paused it here on Thursday. Same general area for any rain with this system. And then maybe a little bit more organization, possibly with this GFS model taking it just a bit farther to the West, maybe somewhere around Florida by late next weekend. So what's driving it? We have two highs and this is the one driving it at first, but note by next weekend we will see these two highs maybe opening up a little place for this to go. You can see it kind of curving off to the north here. So that's why we're thinking somewhere over to the east of us for whatever this ends up being by next weekend. So no threats here. We'll certainly watch everything closely and keep you updated. That's all we know really at this point as that thing is not developed at all.